Hello, welcome to a new episode. So in this episode, we'll see how we can install or use FLTK with Visual Studio. So the easiest way is to uh, actually use CMake for that. So uh, I have a new director here. We want to use the native uh, command tools. So uh, we have the x64 and x86, so we can use uh, either. Uh, I prefer to use the x64. Just change it to that directory. Oops. And here we can uh, basically create, we can first clone the uh, repo itself. Then we use a text editor to create a CMake lists file. So and if you check the repo itself, it has uh, a basic uh, README CMake. You check for add executable. Basically, use this. However, instead of uh, all of this, we'll be using the uh, add subdirectory. So uh, let's say add subdirectory FLTK, and we won't be needing the find package. And here, uh, we'll use the CMake uh, binary there. Okay, yeah. FL2K and FL2K, and here we create a main main.cpp. Call this app, and we'll link the app. Notice the 132 here, and So if you check the directory now, we have all of this. We'll create a uh, bin folder. So now we can basically call the uh, CMake GUI. So it will be the same folder here, the app folder. And then configure, we can choose, uh, for example, have uh, Visual Studio 2017 and finish. So basically, Visual Studio supports uh, CMake projects, and CMake supports creating Visual Studio projects. Project. So if we check here the uh, the configuration, basically you want to disable the uh, examples and the test and the rest we can keep on we don't need the documentation if there's any documentation okay so now we can generate it okay so now if we check the uh the bin folder you can see that we have all of these we need to open the app solution which is the name of the project in the cmake uh, lists.txt file We'll just change the scope to this, so to this, and build.
Okay, not a problem. I'll save this and basically So we get our FLTK window here. We can add, for example, a button. Let's say uh, 60. 200, maybe 40. Uh, FL screen. And This has to be an Apple widget. Okay, so this works. So that was basically it. Uh, if we want to check the same Eclipse uh, file again, so uh, basically it's just the boilerplate, and then we add the uh, git clone subdirectory of FLTK. We include both the CMake current binary dir FLTK plus FLTK. We add our executable, which is a Win32 app, and our uh, source files, and then we target link libraries at FLTK. We can also link other FLTK libs such as FLTK images, etc. Uh, that was basically it for this video. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Bye.